Ah, shit. Ah, okay, okay. You know these EDC videos where you really ask yourself how are these people carrying all that stuff? Well, I'm not like that. I'm just kidding. Hey, my name is Fabian and I'm actually a minimalist. So if you want to see a fancy EDC video where you see expensive all color match tools, you're at the wrong spot. But instead, if you actually want to know what a normal person is carrying with him every day, you're at the right place. Anyway, my parents were kind enough and gifted me an AirTag for Christmas. So if I would ever lose my keys, which never happens, I would find them again. All that, my key setup is very simple. It's just a normal ring and my keys are attached to it because it just works. I have one door opener and a badge for my workplace, my home key as well as the key for my parents' home. Next to it, you will find two keys for my bike, one for my electric bike for the battery and one for the bike lock. And that's it. Ah, I hate cash and I went digital many years ago to an only card wallet. But still, on the back, I have a small spot for some banknotes because if a store resists to go digital, I still have my small backup. The wallet itself is from Anson Calder. It was an expensive purchase and it's actually funny if your wallet is worth more than what's actually in it. Anyway, it's holding up very well, it's leather and it should continue to do so down the line. I had the iPhone 10 for many years since it came out, but actually in the beginning of the year, I switched to the iPhone 13 Pro, which is actually filming me right now. Therefore, it was a big upgrade, not only in video quality, like you can see right now. Other than that, there's not much more to say about it. I'm very happy and I always get a black leather case for my iPhone. I just always find Apple cases to fit best and they still give a luxury feel to your iPhone. Well, it is old. It's the Apple Watch series. Series 4. Well, yes, it is old. I got it four years ago, but it still does more than what I actually need from it. I made a separate video. You can check it out right here, but hold up. First, you finish this video and then you come back to this one. Did you ever watch an EDC video where a guy talks about the lunchbox? No? Well, this is it. This is a simple lunchbox from IKEA. Every day I bring my own food to my work, to my 9 to 5 job and I reheat the food. With this, I probably saved around 1000 bucks or even more by bringing my own food and reheating it instead of spending money on restaurants. Water is important. I'm one of these people who don't drink enough. No matter what, I always forget it. Are you one of them? Let me know down in the comments. However, I wanted to get a good water bottle and I also need a water bottle for hiking. So I came across Hydro Flask with the Tray series. They come in a nice color, lightweight material, isolated and it does its job. And yes, it does its job, it's been holding up for years and I know Hydro Flask is kinda a trend, I get it, but honestly, it does its job, so I like it. This is not anything special. I don't like it, however, it's doing its job, so I'm fine with it. I bought this backpack four years ago in Dubai at the Pull and Bear store. Yes, I was young, I didn't care about backpacks, I needed one and this was it. The material is kind of fake leather, it's been holding up very good, I use it every day. Storage and organization is very limited, therefore I would not recommend it. It does its job, so why should I switch? This was my EDC video from an actual minimalist. Now I don't carry 500 knives, 300 different charges and plugs and everything with me. No, now I'm really curious, what do you actually carry with you every day? Are you as crazy as other YouTubers out there or are you more a normal person like me? Let me know down below. Now, if you remember, I told you about an Apple Watch video. Now is the time to watch it. You can click here and with that being said, I will catch you there. Bye bye.